Hello, Reshma here, and thanks for tuning in. I'm here to show you today how Medplum connects to Epic backend systems. And um, this is an open source implementation I'm going to show you, so make sure to check out the code as well. This implementation has three notable things. First, it's a server to server connection. So this isn't one of those applications that's spinning up a bunch of UI. Second, the implementation is from a Medplum bot and it authenticates to an Epic server via Jot. So we will walk through that in the code sample. Once you've connected to the Epic server, this is a standardish Fire API similar to Medplum. So you'll get a lot of the same features that you get from Medplum when you connect to Epic and you can read and synchronize data that way. Let's see how it works. Here you can see my sample bot, and it will walk through a very simple connect to Epic and query a specific patient. Here you get your key string and client ID, which you get from your Epic sandbox, and you construct all the materials you need to instantiate your client. So look over here. You sign your job just like so and construct the form body as, as shown and authorize to the external Epic server and you'll get an access token here as you can see you can just query the client for a single id as so this is a epic client which is an instantiation of the medplum client our sdk so it has a lot of the similar features though it's not parity one-to-one -one. and you uh, return the json object prior json that you get from the server let's give it a try And here you can see we've queried this patient from Epic. That's it. Really simple hello world application that shows how to authenticate and query a specific patient. 